Good morning and welcome. This is Lorraine Aguilar, founder of Working Harmony, and this is One Gratitude, One Small Success. Here at 10 a.m. in California, those of you who are live with me on Instagram, please type in your comments your gratitude for the day. In the meantime, I'll share with you my gratitude, share a special little song for you, and then scroll through your replies for some shout outs. So here is my gratitude today, and it was directly from this morning. It's for friends who know me well and can be lovingly and gently honest with me in a supportive way. Now I know that's a big mouthful, but what that is, is I had uh, a little uh, physically distant uh, hang out with my friends on, on the marina, one, uh, with a friend on the marina today, and we were just talking, you know, while she was sipping coffee, and uh, I was sharing with her some of the challenges in my life right now. And she reminded me of a time uh, many years ago when I had to move out quickly on, on a day that my car had been stolen and I still had to get out uh, to move out because it was my the day that I needed to clear my apartment. And so I remember her helping me and she noticed that I was getting stuck on trivial stuff because I was so overwhelmed. Like, you know, she just got a big garbage bag next to the refrigerator and just said, Lorraine, throw everything in it. Everything's going. And I'm like, but this is a brand new jar of mustard. I'm sure I could give it to someone. And she's like, Lorraine, let go of the mustard. You got to go. So she reminded me gently that when the challenges that I described to her, she's like, you know, that, Lorraine, this sounds kind of like a mustard jar moment. And it's like, oh, you are so right. I am getting stuck on the details and missing the big picture. So that's my gratitude is for, you know, people in my life who know me well enough, who have enough of a shared history and who can be honest about seeing where I might be getting stuck on things and can gently and lovingly bring that to my attention. So that's a huge gratitude for me today. So what are yours? And let me introduce this song. This is a very special song that I've prepared for someone who's going to be watching the recorded version of this. It's her birthday today. So I'm going to sing the Mexican birthday song. This is for you, Taylor. Eso son las mañanitas que cantaba de David y las muchachas bonitas te las cantamos así. Despierta, mira que amaneció y a los pájaros cantan la luna ya. All right, so, aha! Feliz cumpleaños, Taylor. So let's see what we've got today. We've got um, a gratitude from Happy Ron, and you can find him at happyron.com. Amazing music that he's sharing with the world, very uplifting. Grateful to have that light, that grateful to have that it life and in my music career. Ah, I'm guessing you mean in life. Grateful to have that in life and in my music career. Oh, lovely. I'm guessing you're talking about the qualities that I was describing. Creme brulee. Uh, Judy says, love that song. We tried to learn it in my beginning class. We destroyed it. Oh, well, you know, with practice, of course, you'll get better. So I hope I hope that you'll be singing that song again. And uh, we have Rock On from Happy Ron, and Creme Brulee says, grateful for bees around my citrus trees. Oh yeah, and I bet those bees are certainly grateful for your citrus trees as well. Give them some habitat. And then we also just want to welcome Piccolo Mona Lisa to, to the party this morning. So last call for any gratitude while I go ahead and uh, begin my little closing blessing for you. Mm. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I just want to um, thank those of you who've been sharing and liking this on YouTube and LinkedIn to spread, spread the word and hopefully uplift other people. And uh, for those of you who are here with me, uh, just may you all be kind to yourselves and be kind to each other. May you all take good care of yourselves and take good care of each other. 
because when we are well resourced, we make better decisions. And this is the time for a lot of important decisions right now. And may we all finally be that beautiful part of humanity rising right now as this pandemic reveals the opportunities and the needs in our society, in our life, what's working and what's not working. This is a time for bold decisions and loving decisions and clear, clear-minded and clear-hearted choices. So may you have all of that. And I look forward to seeing you at 5 p.m. today to share our one small success. Thanks so much for tuning in and Taylor, happy birthday.